I just spent 15 minutes in Walmart before I go to area to ride today with Ryan and everybody else and they don't have what I'm looking for. So hopefully I can get that video done tomorrow. That was my plan for today's video. This is the start to the vlog. It's not going out good, I'm already late to the track. Hopefully I can get that video filmed for tomorrow before we get snow. It should be kind of funny, kind of lame probably, but for uh, for the Christmas season, I thought it'd be a pretty funny video. So we're heading to, uh, oh, I almost hit that lady. She's right there, she's probably pissed. Anyways, like I was saying, we're heading up to uh, Area 51 to ride for a little bit, open practice. And uh, yeah, I still gotta stop and get gas and then uh, meet everybody there. I right, just rolled up to the track. We got uh, Ryan over here, Mike over there, other Bailey over here with his uh, new RM250. We're gonna get the bike unloaded and get all my gear on and set up for the day. All right, Mike's here, Bailey's here. I'm getting the bike all warmed up. I got the, uh, I made this sticker up last night, just the vinyl of the holographic and my number plate to put on there, but it's too cold, it's not gonna stick very well. So I'm not even gonna bother to put it on, but we're gonna go do some laps right now and then um, I'll update you guys in a minute. I've been riding for a little bit, my face is so cold. It's a little bit cold today, but um, fun nonetheless. I got the bike, it's not even dirty. Barely gotta wash it, gonna ride tomorrow and hopefully come back here Monday to ride, but um, you, what? You still have the same filter on the bike. No, this fil no, that's the 125 filter. Uh, Look, it says KX125 on it. Because when I came here last time, I just changed out the filter. I had the old, the original, and then I bought a new one and just put the new right one in. Here, right here, right. The dirty one's on the floor in there, so I still gotta clean it. But um, anyways, we're ripping for a little bit. I'll get Ryan out there to uh, get a couple shots on the big track, the intermediate track. There's nine hours on this air filter. There's not. That's yeah, like look at that's your hour four meter. hours on the on the this, air filter, this Mike. Is your stock that's air four, filter that came with the bike. Yeah, I'm gonna throw it out. You had nine hours. That's out. from Gopher. It's got all sand and stuff in it. No, I'm probably not gonna throw it out. I'm probably gonna clean it. You're just it. never gonna clean it. <laughs> it's gonna sit in this bag. I'll just get it, I'll buy a new filter every time I need to change a filter. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm totally, to I'm, I'm totally joking. Totally joking. But um, yeah, Mike, let's go see your filter. Let's go check out your filter then. Mine's clean. I don't know, man. I don't know. We got Bailey over here with the two banger, the RM250. Fitty. Yeah, yeah. Mike, come on, show me your filter, dude. Mine's clean. Let's see it, let's see it. Take your seat off. Uh, all right. That thing's filthy, dude. Nobody that thing is filthy. If you guys haven't seen yet, Ryan put the new uh, blue plastics on his Yamaha. I think it looks a ton better, like you guys are saying in the comments. So he finally followed through with that. For some reason, he left the stock one on, the stock rear fender on there. Don't know why, he still needs a new seat cover on there. But um, yeah, the Yamaha looks good. The Yamaha looks good. Those blue rims though, the blue rims definitely set the thing off. It's so sick. Mike, I don't care that much. You don't gotta show me. I know you wanna prove me wrong right now. Well, I'm sure you got a clean filter you in there. Me to take my seat off. I'm sure it's clean. I believe you. The bagel's mine. I didn't eat breakfast yet. I didn't have time did to eat breakfast. Timbits? No, I didn't get Timbits. You're I so forgot. I did not get Timbits this time. I just got a, a normal donut. What is the ad revenue down? You're on a budget now? No Timbits? No, I paid for the person behind me this morning. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. Because somebody paid for me um, two days ago. They put somebody in front of me paid That's for me. Clean. And then I paid for somebody today behind me. That's pretty clean. Yeah. That's pretty clean. Eh, it's a little dirty. You could use a new filter. <laughs> I'm gonna have a bunch of hate comments. Dude, that filter's brand new. Dude, you. Had I just gotta give Mike a hard time. You, you, you guys don't understand Mike off camera, but if you did, you would understand why I treat Mike like this. So, um, yeah, until you meet Mike in person, or if you're friends with him for longer than five days, you'd understand. <laughs> My Xbox name. I swear. To God. Mike's got the Gasser F250 over here. <laughs> It really is gas though, it's not diesel. Yeah, definitely don't kind of clean this puppy up. Just the tires are practically dirty for the most part. Not bad, not bad. How you feeling today? I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah? It's kind of cold. Yeah? yeah they yeah. couldn't hear you over the bike. It's kind of cold. Yeah, it's know, a little cold today. Going. It's okay. It's you, December. You got, you got the, the usual, oh, you got a chest protector under Dude, there too? Nah. No. Hoodie and a flannel. Going nice. all out. Mike just got the, the under armor, not there. even. What'd you say? When you nailed me with a rooster Oh, uh, you roosted do? You? Uh, you caught, you did. No, you roosted. I did. He can't roost himself. Oh, Alright, so you're gonna go train, we're gonna get some footage or something? No, we're not training. No, we're not, actually at fault. We're not gonna train, we're not gonna train. It's alright.
Aided on the Yamaha, I had to move his bike off the uh, off the track because he was laying on the side. But he's all good now. He didn't break anything. He just knocked the wind out of himself. But we got Austin over here doing the filming. Thank you. Yeah. Give me nuts. Sick. And um, yeah, super fun day. We're just ripping around. We were on the intermediate track for most of the morning, and now like the the big track's like perfect. So uh, yeah, we're just having a good time. And I'm probably gonna head out here in the next like 45 minutes or so because it's already three o'clock and. The sun is already going down at three o'clock, so. Didn't get too much footage, but um, I don't know. A lot of you finally got some footage of me riding, so hopefully you guys enjoy that. And um, other people are riding and stuff like that. Riding way better than me, throwing crazy whips way better than me. But um, what are you gonna do? I'll get there eventually. I'm gonna rip around for a little bit and then uh, head out, like I said. So I've just rode for the past like hour straight because Austin was out there filming for me. Huge shout out to Austin for recording. Thank you very, very much. That's awesome. Finally got some riding footage of myself. Bike, like I said before, doesn't have to uh, doesn't even have to be clean. I'm gonna go ride tomorrow again and then hopefully come back here on Monday, like I was saying in the beginning of this vlog, because it's supposed to be like 55 degrees. Like who knew in December I would still be riding? Like that's why I sold my snowmobile. Oh, nah. I thought about buying another snowmobile, but I'm gonna try to get that. Uh, I'd ride the pit bike in the snow, but depending on how much we have, you can't really ride the pit bike in like two or three feet of snow. So, anyways, I don't think I'm gonna buy a sled. Maybe if I find one for a good deal, I'll buy one, but for right now, I'm probably not gonna end up doing that. And the money, I don't know if I posted that video before or after, but the 125 pill is a lot of money, a lot more than I thought, because I have to buy all um, OEM parts from the 17, like. I'm probably gonna make a full dedicated video on the 125 and what I need to do to it and hopefully um, get everything good in like this month in December. But the tank, the seat, the swing arm, not the swing arm, the subframe, um, a new swing arm, pie, like just the OEM, the tank, the subframe and the seat alone is like, in the end, hopefully it comes out sick 
and uh, it'll be well worth it, I'm sure. Me and Mike are still here with the last ones riding. Ryan left, Bailey left, a few other people left we were hanging out with. I'm gonna load up the bike, and then um, head out of here. I can't believe this just happened. I didn't get it on film. Of course, when I don't film it, I was helping Mike load his bike, like always. Of course, he comes up the ramp, he drops the whole bike, it falls sideways on the tailgate, almost falls off, it clicks into gear, you can't push it anymore. I'm, at, I'm pretty upset I didn't get that on video. What's the explanation? Coming up the ramp, I think I might have clicked the, my shifter with my ankle. Into gear? Yeah. So Dude, it was literally, it was laying sideways on the tailgate. Well, no, it wasn't on the gate, it was on me. <laughs> I was holding it. All right, well, for I, now on, I for now on, I am 100% recording every single load that Mike ever does in this truck for now on. I, I have to, dude. All the good stuff happens when you don't record no, it, unfortunately. When I broke the tray. Oh, you got it when you broke the tray, when, but when I, I haven't I gotten the, the second, third, fourth, fifth time. This would be the sixth, you know? Video. Damn, always, always. driving home right now I seriously you cannot complain about riding in December it's like December I don't know what the date is today regardless it's December and we're riding dirt bikes like I don't remember last year riding dirt bikes in December maybe I could have maybe there was a few nice days but I'm pretty sure in the next like couple weeks or so we're definitely gonna have snow and uh, but I'm trying to get the most uh, most amount of riding in now while we don't have snow while it's decently nice outside and it's not like super cold the uh, before oh just missed my exit as I'm vlogging. Nice, Tyler. Nice. This is why you don't. This is why you don't vlog and drive. Don't for kids for up and coming vloggers. Do not vlog and drive. It's very dangerous and it probably is illegal. Don't really know if you can get pulled over for it, but I'm pretty sure holding a camera and talking to yourself is uh, is illegal while driving. Anyways, I'm gonna stop vlogging and driving. I'll update you guys when I get to the house, get everything unloaded, and then I'll cap the video off there. All right, so I just pulled in home. I'm gonna cap the video off here. I know there wasn't a ton of GoPro, or there wasn't any GoPro because I didn't put the GoPro on. But um, regardless, hope you guys enjoyed the video. A lot more of uh, me riding and stuff like that. And look out for uh, tomorrow's video or the next day's video from uh, the private track we're going to ride tomorrow with Ryan, Mike, a few other people. And uh, yeah, should be sick. I got a cool little idea if I can find the thing tonight. If I can go buy it at Walmart or some other store around me that has it. So stay on the lookout for that. Should be pretty funny. And um, yeah, off of that, if you're new, hit the subscribe button. Give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.